Hey everybody, this is Donna with Johnny's Used Cars. Voted the best place to buy a car in Okinawa by the military community of Okinawa. Today I'm sure there's 2012 Suzuki Lapan. It's got 75,000 kilometers on it, which is about 46,000 miles. Before I get started, I'd like to let you know that we do have on a lot discounts. So the price you're seeing on the website right now will not be the final price when you come on a lot. Also, if you're arriving to Okinawa soon or you just arrived, Please make sure you stop by Johnny's Used Cars as soon as you can and have a look around. Even before you get yourself a driver's license, there are benefits of doing it that way. So with that, let's have a look around. I'll show the features inside. But first, I'd like to ask you to please watch the video until the end. I do go over a lot of information in my videos. going to answer a lot of your questions. Things like the JCI, the warranty, the financing. I cover all that and more. So please bear with me till the end. You have all the answers. If not, please contact me or stop on by. The Suzuki Lapan is a four passenger vehicle in the yellow plate category, so the smaller category. Road tax per year is going to be uh, 3,000 yen, which is about $25 right now with the current exchange rate. Road tax is due every April May time frame, so we're going to take care of the new 2024 road tax for you. You won't have to worry about that for another year. Now, you do have two ways to pay for this first one being US dollars cash outright, which could get you a larger discount. Or take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months with zero down. Yes, we don't have a down payment requirement, but if you want to put something down, reduce your overall monthly payments, you can. A lot of our customers would like 500 to 1,000. Some do half, some do more. Up to you. Before we go inside, I was like showing the rain guards. Rain guards will allow you to roll your windows down a little bit this way. If it rains, it's not going to get wet inside. More important feature benefit is it's going to give you a cross ventilation. Get that extremely hot air out. And always get yourself a good windshield visor. Try to keep that dash as cool as possible. Let's uh, jump on inside, get this thing started. All right, the key fobs. Uh, now, if it has this little metal plate there, hopefully you can see that. You want to keep that in a safe place because if you lose these remotes, that's what's going to help you get a new one or get new ones. But you definitely don't want to lose the remotes. They're expensive. Okay, key fob on your person, foot on a brake. It is a push start. Push that one time and it goes. Okay. So you got the little bunny there saying hello. 74,766 on the odometer. Uh, showed a couple of warning lights. That green, whoa. Turn that radio off. Sorry, Troy. That green one right there is your temperature gauge. So it's gonna be green when the engine's cool. It's gonna go and it's gonna stay on, that's normal. It'll go away when the engine warms up. Again, that's normal. And then it's gonna be red if it's overheating. That's not normal, be on the lookout for that. Um, the one right next to it is your seatbelt one. Make sure you wear your seatbelts. They do give tickets on and off base. And that uh, circular one over there is your emergency brake. This one's a kick type, so when you kick it, disengage, it goes away. Kick it again, comes right back on. Other than, what? Other than that, very simple, straightforward, straight ahead instrument cluster. Anything pops up on a dash while you're driving, please pull, pull over, find out what it is, take the necessary action. Off to the left here, on top of the dash, you have a little vent here that's gonna help uh, bring the air back to the uh, rear seats. Then you have your uh, radio, this one does not have a rear camera. You have your uh, shifter, air conditioning controls, cup holder, power outlet, and then a little compartment here for some storage. Above the glove box, you got a little bit of storage. You have to be careful how you open this. This is as far as it goes. A lot of people do it too much and break it. Just be careful of that. So you got a little space right there. And then under, you have the uh, glove box. And then you have a little bit of storage on each door panel. That is your passenger space over there. You got your red road flare hanging out. And then this is the space I have on my side. The seat is all the way back, all the way down. I am 5'11", as everybody loves knowing. Um, I'm pretty comfortable right where I am. Let's go, and it does have an armrest. I've been doing pretty good with these. All right, let's go eye level. That's my eye level right there. Really can't see anything past the windshield wipers like on most vehicles. Now normally I take this time to show the auction sheet, showing you that this is a non-accident vehicle from mainland Japan. Please keep that in mind. Uh, graded non-accident from the auctions up in mainland. Well, there's other dealers out here can't tell you that. We can on all our cars. But because this just came in, um, I put those, I keep those inside the office to a bit detail. Once detailed, it's gonna go up here on the sun visor, on the driver's side, so you can see that for yourself. All right, let's show you a couple other things before we go to the back. All right, so over here, you do have a cup holder on each uh, side of the dash. Um, you have a little um, um, shelf here. This is uh, just for a couple coins, and this guy over here, that's to control the angle of your headlights. So maybe it's a foggy morning, you want to see the street a little better, that's where you're going to do it. And then you have your hood release over here. And then please don't forget down here, next to the, um, the seat on the floor, you have your gas cover release. 
Then on the door panel, you have your uh, uh, windows and door lock controls, okay? And to turn it off, your foot doesn't have to be on a brake. You just push this one time, and it goes. All right. Over here. All right, so here's your rear space. Looks like somebody forgot their stuff right here. I'm going to go over it. All right. So with the seat all the way back, all the way down, I'm about an inch away from the back seat to my knees. Nothing as far as storage on the back of the driver's seat, but you have pocket storage on the back of the passenger seat. As always, be careful what you put in there. You don't want to rip it on each side. And then a little bit of storage and cup holder on each door panel. Uh, no uh, center console since this is a four-passenger uh, vehicle, okay? Let's go back here. You got the good old rabbit's head as a dotted eye. This is your rear space. So if you need extra space on each side over here and here, there's a lever. All you're going to do is pull it towards you, and that's going to put that down. And then you can see how much space you have. Just all the space. Pretty impressive. Okay? Let me show you with the other one. Look at how much space there is. All right. Let's go to the front here. Show the engine compartment. They're going to wrap this video up. And of course, you got more rabbit bling. And why is that? Go ahead and let me know in the comments. All right. There you have it. This is the 660cc engine. Nice and clean. The big powerhouse. All right. And there you have it. 2012 Suzuki Lapan. 75,000 kilometers or approaching 75,000 kilometers on it. What you get? About 46,000 miles. Military price goes down to 5200 With an additional military discount, we'll get it down to uh, 5000 flat. Again, while you're here, please ask the information guy about on a lot discounts, and you will get a lower price on this. But for now, the uh, uh, 5000 is going to include a two-year JCI, the one-year bumper-to-bumper full warranty, the new 2024 road tax, and the 10% sales tax is already included. Only thing on top will be the American insurance requirement. Whether you're going to liability or full coverage, which is totally up to you, and we can assist you with that here. Touching on these warranties real quick, yes, there are two-year warranties out here. However, they're not the best thing since sliced bread, so don't be fooled by them. Stop by, we'll explain why. But we do encourage you to shop around, go to the dealer, see what they have, check out the condition, mileage, and pricing of their vehicles, then stop by Johnny's Used Cars, let us show what we have, what our program's all about, and how we're going to assist you. We are definitely making a difference out here because we are different. One of the many reasons why we did win the Stars and Stripes, Best Pacific Magazines, Best Place to Buy a Car in Okinawa Award. Stop by, we'll show you why, like we have many, many others. Don't forget two ways to pay for it. U.S. dollars cash outright, or take advantage of zero percent financing for 24 months. Either way, we're good to go. Please like and subscribe, and as always, thank you very much for watching. Take care. Hope to see you soon.